Hey guys, so today we're going to try a very fun, different product from Maybelline. It is their Python Metallic Lip Kits. They look like this. So if you guys are interested in seeing these swatches, and I'm also going to try a few on the lips, so if you're interested in seeing what these are all about, then just keep watching. Okay, so in each metallic lip kit, you get two products. So let me show you what it looks like. Inside it has the Maybelline New York logo. You pop it open, and you get like a cream and a powder. So you're supposed to put like the cream product on your lips first, and then top it with the like shimmery shadow shadow product with the like powdery product. So let me show you. So that's like the lip cream. And then that is like the powder topper. We'll do swatches of the entire collection on the arm and then we'll play with a few on the lips. Okay, so there are eight total. We'll go in order. The first one is 05 Passionate. And inside you get like a red cream and like a shimmery cranberry color, very pretty. This one's very soft. So here is the red cream. Here is the powder. And then topped. You see this side has the topper. I put the topper on this side of the swatch. So cream, powder, and both. That might be pretty. Next we have 10 piercing. It's like we have like a deep gray and like a shimmery taupey gray. Looks more like a purple. And then topped. That's pretty. That almost looks like a green-brown pigment. I don't know if you guys can see that. Looks really neat. Next, we have 15 Venomous. This one's like blue and gold, it looks like. Hmm, that shadow looks gorgeous. Shadow, I keep saying shadow. This powder looks stunning. Let's see what we have here. Navy. Ooh, like a bright thought this was like a dark color. This is like a bright tealy blue. And this powder topper, which looks stunning. Ooh. Now let's try them together. Ooh, that's gorgeous. Look at that. Okay. I might want to try this one. Next up, we have 20 Wild, which looks like pink and gold. Hot pink and gold. These powders are so soft. I wonder if they can be used on the eyes. They're really good. And together. That's pretty. It's like a nice kind of like peachy, peachy sheen. Next we have 25 and this one, I ripped the name off of it. So 25, let's say inside what it's called. 25, this one's called Valiant. Bright purple and again, a really cool duochrome powder. Purple. This really cool Duo chromy powder, it's like blue, green, taupey color. I don't know, that's really beautiful. Oh, well, that's another fun combination. It looks really blue when you put it over the purple. Fun. Next is 30 Provoked. It looks like a nice muted color combination. Okay, looks like a tan and a goldish. has more pink in it than I thought. And it would be fun to play up with these, like this one with maybe this cranberry copper color might be gorgeous. Let's stick with the combinations they gave us first. 
that's pretty. Very subtle, pretty. 35 Snake Bite, it's a fun name. Teal and Gold. This one's definitely more green than this one. This is more of like a blue, this is more green. That shadow is metallic, that powder. I keep saying shadow, but that powder is super metallic. Gorgeous. All right, let's try them together. Hmm. Not sure I'd wear that on my lips, but that's a fun combination. And the last one is 40 Untamed. This one looks like a darker combination. This one looks like black and like a goldish black powder. Let's see if this is black. I think so. Yep. Black lip cream. Here's the black and here is the powder. It's like a nice black with gold shimmer. Can you guys see? Oh, you guys couldn't see it. I'm so sorry. Here's the black with the gold powder. Let's try it over the top. Hmm, that's pretty. Again, not one that I would wear. And sorry if you couldn't see the earlier one. The earlier one was this dark green with the gold powder, and this is what it looks like together. So here are all of the Python kit combinations. We have the red and the cranberry, the brown and the taupe, the deep blue and like this greenish peach duochrome, pink and like peach combination, purple and this blue duochrome, brown and this like champagne duochrome, teal and gold, and black and black and gold. Really fun. All right, so which one do we want to try? I set aside a couple that I wanted to try. All right, so I wanna try the taupe one, which will be very neutral. I really wanna try this dark blue and duochrome one. How about we try the black one last? All right, so we will try 40 untamed, we will try 30 provoked, and we will try 15 venomous. Let's go with the lightest one first so it doesn't stain the lips. I'm just gonna use my fingers today but I don't have any lip brushes handy because they are mostly packed. So there's the lip cream. It's a nice color, it's like your lips but better. Now let's try the shadow on top. I guess I will just press it along the center. Okay, it's a lipstick with like a shadow on top of it. I mean, it's fun, but nothing like earth shattering. We'll try some more. So here is 30 Provoked. I would wear this one. Okay, next we will try 15, the blue and duochrome one. Oh boy.
Okay, so here is the blue cream. I think blue lips can be fun. Not very wearable, but they're fun. And then we have the powder. Ooh. Yes, please. That's fun. Okay, so it goes from like a matte blue teal to like an iridescent green blue lip. It's fun. Makes my teeth look gray, <laughs> but it's fun. Maybe I'll wear these in a future video. It's like a liquid lipstick or it's like a metallic lipstick, but it's not liquid. I feel like you could probably just use a liquid lipstick and then a shadow on top. I don't know if you're supposed to use eye products on the lips, but if it were lip safe, I feel like essentially that's what they're giving you. They're giving you a lipstick and like a shadow type of thing that you could create this look with. Fun, different. Am I sold? Not yet. So here is 15 Venomous. I don't quite think it looks like this. Maybe I need to pack it on. I feel like to look like this one, you would have to add one of those golds from the other packs. Let's try it here. I feel like to get this look, you need to also pile on this gold. So let's try it. Do I look like the picture? fun. Definitely not every day, but it is fun. And then the last one we're going to try today is 40 Untamed. That was the black and gold one, this one. So let's give it a try. I don't think I ever wear black lips, so let's see. Okay, so my lips are black. Let's try this topper. It just makes it black lips with a gold shine. I don't know, I don't, I don't see the appeal. If you want black and gold lips, don't you just get a black lipstick with gold pearls in it if that's what you want? I feel like this is a lot of mess to get a look that would be very easy to get with a lipstick or a liquid lipstick. I don't know. <laughs> For me, I just don't see the appeal of these. Yes, they are fun. Yes, you can get different looks with these combinations. I mean, there's a lot you can do with these. You can come up with all sorts of different combinations using these colors. But is this something that I would recommend and say you need to go out and buy right away? No, it's really not. I feel like you could just find a lipstick and if you wanted a little bit of shine, pop on a gloss. If you wanted a little bit of shine, find an eyeshadow and just dab it onto your lips. I just don't see the appeal of these little compacts that you either need a brush or need to use your fingers with. Just too much mess, too much fuss for me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this swatch and try on video of the Maybelline Python kits. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.